What's up YouTube, JT here. Coming to you guys with a crazy, crazy video today. I just wanna let you guys know, the lighting is crazy right now. We're on the beach. I'm currently working on a super, super dope piece with CBS and Under Armour. It's gonna be crazy. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit behind the scenes of what an actual kind of interview type movie scene looks like. And this is how they do it. So stay tuned. So I don't know if you guys can see right now, we're on the beach. They're setting up this thing called a dolly. Um, I guess it's gonna, it's gonna zoom in and out on me. It's gonna be so crazy. I can't wait to the final product because I'll have the link to the final product in the description below. But listen, it's gonna be crazy. This is, this is awesome. And action. So we're about to take another shot of me kind of walking up into the beach. I'm telling you, it's, it's, this thing is going to be crazy. CBS is, is doing her thing. Check this out. All right, guys, so we just finished up the beach section. Now we're about to go head to the workout facility. They're going to film me on the field. They're going to film me in the during the workout. Yo, I'm telling you, these shots are going to be crazy. Like, CBS is doing it right. So stay tuned. All right, guys, we on the field right now. They're about to rig me up to this huge camera. And it's about to be sitting out in front of me like this, how I'm talking to you guys. And it's going to see all of my movements. So... I'm, yeah, it's, it's just wild. I've never been part of a production like this. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So right here, you can see they're hooking me up to this huge machine. It's actually going to hold up the camera right in front of me. In the back, there are like some counterweights to help balance out the front while I'm going through my movements. But it's kind of heavy, too. The front desk? I'm all hooked up now. Okay, oh, shout out to my man. Shout out to my guy Adam, man. I'm about to get me right, man. Sister mate. We in the building, got the crew in the back. And it's crazy because they can see me saying this right now into this camera. This is wild. So we're about to get into it. It's gonna be a lot of dope, cool shots. I just can't wait for y'all to see it. The final piece is gonna be crazy. It's squeezing, this is squeezing squeeze in my stomach right now not too bad though i like it snug because when you're doing a bunch of movements you don't want it going everywhere so we'll get into it yeah they're speeding you do one where he's like kind of like you're kind of like running forward and catch it and then you kind of move off with it so just kind of be in a motion and hey you can spin with it Nice. All right, speeding. Here we go. Nice. All right, guys. We got the working outside. Now, bro, they have the smoke in the weight room. They have lights outside shining in through the window. It's about to be crazy. It's gonna look dramatic. I'm about to get some real weight room work in now. So this is gonna be a dope shot. Arms up, step off, keep on that. Bam! Nice, good. Step down, one more. Light on your feet. Light on your feet, light land, light land. 
So now we're about to go into our lifting session as far as upper body. You can see their, their cameras are right there by me, so they're trying to get a lot of close-up shots of my face, how my mentality looks before I'm going to attack the bar. So, I mean, the whole thing came together great. Like, it's crazy. Working on our speed and power, speed and power. football player but at the same time athletically gifted more than more than most more than most football players so but you know going with that there's a lot of athletically gifted people but what separates JT from the others is his workouts the way he works his determination to the sport his mental recovery his physical recovery his nutrition all combined it's the little things that take these great players to the next level there's a lot of great running backs but not all of them are doing what he's doing. When you're doing, he do, when you're doing what he's doing, you set yourself up for the future, to be a future Hall of Famer, you know, go, whatever you want to call it. This is what he's doing, and, and, and I would say that's the main two things that separated him from the rest of the people. 